Apple Volume Purchase Program. What is Apple VPP? Apple Volume Purchase Program helps you find, purchase, and distribute apps and books in bulk for your organization. Do you need Apple VPP? If you have only a handful of Apple devices and you usually don't provision apps for them, you may not need VPP. However, if you want to distribute apps or books to a substantial number of devices, it would be a good idea to join VPP. The best part is that you can purchase in bulk, both free and paid apps, and have them silently rolled out to your employee devices. Moreover, you can have third-party developers design and build custom apps for your specific needs and distribute them privately and securely through the VPP store. And yes, you can use the same DEP account for VPP. As for the distribution, there are a couple of ways. Redemption codes. These are codes that are designed for a one-time use. Once deployed, this cannot be reused. Thus, the apps will become user-owned. Managed distribution. Here, the organization is the sole owner of the apps and the app licenses can be reused again and again. Getting started with VPP. If you already have DEP, you can use that same account for VPP. Otherwise, you will need to create a new agent account. The steps for the agent account creation is same as that of DEP. Check out the link in the description for more details on creating your agent account. Once you have signed up for VPP, you're good to purchase apps in bulk and seamlessly roll them out to devices via Hexnode MDM. But first, you've got to configure VPP on your Hexnode MDM portal. Start by logging into your VPP portal, account summary, and download the VPP token. Now, head over to your Hexnode MDM portal, admin, Apple VPP, Upload the VPP token and save. Be sure to check Reclaim Licenses. This will free up any VPP licenses you may have used with another MDM. All those licenses will be reclaimed for you to use within Hexnode MDM. It's syncing. Any licenses you may have purchased before, assigned users, all will show up after the sync. Now, we had used this VPP account previously. That's why it's showing these stats. If you just set up yours, you may still see as 00. Either way, this token is valid for a year and you should renew it before expiry. Let's try purchasing an app. I'm going to go with Google Keep. 200 licenses, review, and place order. Now, open up your Hexnode MDM portal. Do a VPP sync. Done syncing? Go to Apps. Search the app. VPP, 200 licenses. All good. Let's go ahead and distribute this app. There are a couple of ways you can do this. You can either set this app as a mandatory app via policies, or do a quick direct install. Create a new policy. Add this app to mandatory and assign this policy to a device or a device group as a whole. Mandatory apps policy targets. If you save this policy, this app will be set to automatically install on all the devices in that group. Let's not do that now. Let's try the direct install so that I can show you the actual app installation on a device. So we go to management and choose a device. Install application. Let me grab the device. Yep, app installation has already started without any user interaction. Installing and done. One license used assigned to one device. Click for more info. You can view the summary here. 
This app has been associated directly to Brian's iPad, so no need of an Apple ID or signing into the App Store. Now, what if you want to retire this app license to be reissued for another device? Well, then just select the device and revoke license. Disassociation requested. We just have to get the refresh data. Again to zero, so it has been revoked and you're back with 200 unused licenses. As for the app installed on the device, it won't be uninstalled right away. Apple provides a 30-day grace period just so the user can back up any data on the app. Pretty neat, huh? Well, you can always initiate a manual uninstall from the portal, the same way you'll remove any managed app, but that's for another video entirely. For now, celebrate that you have mastered volume purchase and silent app distribution through Apple VPP. Cheers. Bye-bye. Thank you.